This ain't what you want. So just um to clarify some things, um I am let me put it to you like this. As far as alien feet, the music department goes. As far as alien feet, beats and treats, the music department goes. I don't have physical a physical a record company at this time. It's not a physical building, is what I'm saying. It's not a physical building. The the company is right. Excuse me. My label is under my company, Alien Feet. But I don't have a physical building. Right. I have the submarine. Right. I don't have a physical building. Right. So Alien Feet is remote this is why i work like this we work remotely because there's no physical building everyone has their own studio right all of my actual artists have their own studios right right they were artists before i came along right right so they have their own studios their own programs whatever they do right right and then my husband has red brick right here in syracuse right so Red Brick Records here in Syracuse, right? So, well, I guess I do have a physical building, but it's, well, I guess I do, right? <laughs> but that's Red Brick, excuse me, right? That's not Alien Feet. That's not Beats and Treats, excuse me. That's not Beats and Treats. That is Red Brick. That is my husband's. That's not mine. He had that before. Well, I guess he didn't, right? It's his. If he put something together before I was physically involved, involved or asked for it, in my mind, it belongs to him. And it doesn't matter if we get divorced. It's his. Right. I have Beast and Treats. Beast and Treats does not have a physical building. So I work remotely with my, my actual artists. There is no building. So that's why I said it. Whoever is out there running around signing people and stuff like that, excuse me. No. You didn't have a meeting with me. You are not my artist. Excuse me, let me tell you something. If you didn't have a meeting with Raffaello, you are not my artist. Because Raffaello is over everything that I have. No, his name ain't on my shit. But he's over everything. He's the overseer of everything. Why? Because I told him he could be. Why? Because he's my husband. Why? My father chose him. Why? Because my father trusted his father. Right. And God told me I could trust Raffaello with everything of mine. And Raffaello brought me everything of his and put it all in my name, right? Everything Raffaello owns is in my name. Right. So he has access to everything I have. No, it's not in his name. But he has access to everything I have. And he oversees all of my businesses, right? Because why? He did the footwork. He started them for me, right? He did the footwork. He made the phone calls and shit. I'm busy yelling at y'all. Right, and healing from having coronavirus. So he was doing the footwork and making the phone calls. That's why he's over everything. He knows where everything is and what everything does. But I do not have a physical record company at this time. Record company. Nope, there's no building for beats and treats. So, there are no signed artists other than whom I've mentioned. Right, so all these little side youngins, you must belong under Millions label. Anyone under Millions label is Millions artists. They're not beats and treats. I told y'all that. His label is nothing to do with me, right? His artists are his artists. Hello, he and I were supposed to be temporary. So whomever he brings to the table, he will want to take with him, right? Right, so therefore... Anyone under Millions label belongs to him. They're not beats and treats. Right. Mm-mm. And he wants to have raunchy music. And raunchy videos. Okay, I can't have that. And I don't want that. Right. So. Once again. Anything that has to do with Millions has nothing to do with Davinia. Right. Nothing. He is not over any of my companies or anything. If you're a temporary person, why would you be given my assets to handle? That's stupid. I have advisors. <laughs> I have accountants. 
I have people that you heard me saying, excuse me, even Laurent can't have access to my money unless I'm with him. Right. Lauren has his own money. Oh, uh, excuse me. Uh, Raffaello has his own money. So he doesn't have to use my money. And we don't have tabs and all that shit. I told everybody that. So, like I said, there's no one who can use my name and put a bill on me. So if anyone was out there using my name, promising you stuff, and it didn't come through, go see that motherfucker or that bitch because it ain't got nothing to do with me. I didn't have any a street team. I didn't have a man and a woman running around doing anything for me. I do everything for myself because what do I want to do? This is my company. I need to see everybody personally. Yay, nay, right? You don't bring what you want to my table and tell me to eat it. I order my dish, right? And it better be what the fuck I ordered, how the menu say it's going to be. Or you can hide that back, right? You can hide that back, right? So no disrespect to anyone, but if Millions signed you, you're under his label. You're not under Beats and Treats because Millions is not under my label. He chose to be independent, right? He chose not to to um be up under me, right? Because he wanted, right? It's like when he leaves, he wants his artist, right? So we're not about to do anything legal, to, right? We're not about to have a big fight over artists when he leaves. So his label is not affiliated with Beats and Treats, Alien Feet, nothing. Millions is not affiliated with me at all. He's been totally fight. How about that? Totally dismissed from Divine's life. Totally. I told you it wasn't going to last long. Totally dismissed from my life. Because I didn't think I'm empress. I was trying to do stuff, you know, the legal American way. But I'm an empress. I don't have to put up with nobody's shit. Right. I let this dude exhaust himself out of my life. And he did so. And I do mean legally. Right. You cheat on your wife. What happens? You abandon your wife. What happens? The marriage is annulled. And it was never a marriage. It was a guardianship. Right, you don't even know what guardianship means. Guardianship does not mean marriage. You and I were not married, right? Right. After he explained it to me again, he was like, and it's not even a, a biblical marriage, shorty. Right, it was just guardianship, right? Protective guardianship. Davinia's mind is all there, and she's not a child, so she doesn't need anybody to guard her money, right? She has people for that. My leg's going to be hurting. Not my motherfucking body, right? My mind is still here, right? Her father knows how to manage her money. She gave my father permission to manage her money. Why the hell do we need millions managing her money? You're a temporary man, right? She has no intentions of falling in love with you, right? She said, I may love you, but I ain't going to fall in love with you because I have a husband and I have children with her, right? I'm not trying to start a whole life with you. You weren't part of the plan. I'll be single first, right? Ain't nobody about to just start throwing husbands and shit on me. But I will give you an equal shot as a husband. Because that was something that you and my husband came up with. My husband's like, I ain't come up with none of this shit. <laughs> right. Schemes, scams, and spiritual bullshit is where all this shit came from with millions. C'est la vie. C'est la vie. C'est la vie. You don't start no shit in my life. So, once again, this is a business... Correction. Millions is not affiliated with Divinia, period. Whether it be personal or business. He got some big lip, pink big lip chick. And he got some dark skin, yardy bitch. Right. I'm neither. Right. And then he said he had three, three chicks houses he go to. Right. Hey, I, I know damn well he wasn't talking about me. Right. So he might got three chicks. 